In this video, I'm gonna share the best shampoos for hair loss, or more specifically, the scientifically proven most effective ingredients to stop hair loss, which can be included in a shampoo formula. So if you're buying a shampoo to stop your hair loss, here's what to look out for. And at the end of the video, I'll share a couple of ingredients that you really want to avoid because they actually cause hair loss or at least contribute to it. Okay, so let's jump in and get started. First up, caffeine. After minoxidil, caffeine has gradually but unmistakably emerged as the second most popular topical hair growth compound that does not work via DHT inhibition. We all know caffeine, a naturally occurring compound found in coffee, tea, and cacao beans. And just like it stimulates the nervous system when consumed orally, it has a similar effect on the hair follicles when applied topically to the scalp. We know this from studies conducted both in vitro, namely with hair follicles grown on a Petri dish, as well as actual clinical studies with balding men. An early study out of Italy found that after four months of applying a topical caffeine solution, 83% of patients with hair loss showed an improvement. A further study involving 210 men with male pattern baldness compared the effects of a caffeine solution and Rogaine, which is minoxidil, applied daily over six months. Amazingly, both treatments produced similar results. The Rogaine group showed an average 11.7% increase in actively growing hairs, and the caffeine group showed a 10.6% increase a difference that was not statistically significant. Participants and dermatologists reported comparable improvements in hair loss and thickness for both groups. Dermatologists recommended continued treatment for 98% of the men in the caffeine group and 100% of the Rogaine group. So according to this study, you get essentially the same regrowth as minoxidil, but from a natural compound without any major side effects. A large part of the reason for caffeine's effectiveness is that when applied topically on the scalp, it's absorbed primarily through the follicles, meaning it targets exactly what you want from a hair loss topical. Okay, next up we have olive leaf extract or oleuropine. Oleuropine is a major constituent of olive leaves. Apart from its antioxidant activity, oleuropine has anti-inflammatory, antiviral, and even antimicrobial effects. And due to its low molecular weight, it's easily absorbed through the skin. A 2015 study found that topical oleuropine activates the WNT catenine signaling pathway, which regulates the antigen phase of the hair growth. In cultured human dermal papilla cells, oleuropine enhance cell proliferation and increase the expression of key genes and proteins that regulate the hair growth cycle. When applied topically to mice, oleuropine accelerated hair growth, increased hair follicle size, and upregulated various genes that are associated with hair growth. All of this without any side effects. Next up is vitamin E or tocopherol. Vitamin E is a major fat dissolving antioxidant in the body of all mammals, including humans. And by antioxidant, we mean a substance that protects against free radicals, which are harmful molecules that disrupt your body's metabolism, as well as overall well-being. An excess of free radicals has been implicated in most forms of hair loss, including androgenetic alopecia. Studies have also found that some types of hair loss, the patients have significantly lower levels of vitamin E compared to healthy controls. The most common form of vitamin E that you'll find is tocopherol, which is biologically active and well absorbed. In addition to its potential benefits for hair growth and health, tocopherol is a natural preservative and can help extend the shelf life of hair care products. It's commonly found in shampoos, conditioners, and other hair care products for this reason. Okay, the next ingredient is biotin. Biotin, also known as vitamin B7, is a water-soluble vitamin involved in a variety of metabolic pathways. One of these involves the production of keratin, which is the primary structural protein that gives our hair their form, strength, and elasticity. Keratin is also a major structural protein in the skin and nails. Accordingly, the symptoms of biotin deficiency include hair loss, 
eczema and brittle nails. A 2016 study found that more than one out of three women with hair loss were biotin deficient. Biotin is low cost and widely available in various cosmetic products for hair, skin, and nails. And it can be consumed both orally and topically like in a shampoo. Next, we have taurine, an amino acid that's found naturally in the body. It's actually the most common intracellular amino acid in the human body. Like vitamin E, taurine is known to have antioxidant properties, which means it can help protect cells from damage caused by free radicals. And while there is limited research on the direct effects of taurine on hair growth, some studies suggest it may have potential benefits for hair health. For example, a study published in 2019 found that a topical solution containing taurine improves the results of PRP treatments in men and women with hair loss. Another study used an oral supplement containing taurine and reported similar positive results. Bamboo extract is another natural and safe topical compound that can benefit hair regrowth in men and women with AGA. Bamboo extract is rich in silica, a mineral that supports the health of nails, skin, and hair. Bamboo leaves are actually estimated to be made up of silica up to a whopping 70%. Silica also helps stimulate the production of healthy collagen in the scalp, improving its strength and elasticity. Next up is apple cider vinegar. While apple cider vinegar does not directly promote hair growth, it can be very beneficial in terms of restoring your scalp's overall health. This in turn provides the hair follicles with an optimal environment to regrow. The reason is that apple cider vinegar is a safe but powerful antifungal. So for example, many people with fungal growths on their nails are able to completely resolve their symptoms by dipping the affected nail daily in apple cider vinegar. When applied topically on the scalp, apple cider vinegar can help restore the natural pH balance and relieve symptoms like flaking, itching, or full-blown dandruff. Which brings us to the next compound on today's list, ketoconazole. This is an antifungal medication that's typically used in shampoos to treat dandruff and related conditions. However, it's also been shown to have a beneficial effect on hair loss even though it's not marketed for this indication. Research has suggested that ketoconazole may be effective in reducing hair loss by inhibiting the activity of the enzyme 5-alpha reductase, which converts testosterone into DHT. Regular viewers of this channel will know that DHT is the primary hormone implicated in male pattern baldness. By inhibiting the activity of 5-alpha reductase and reducing DHT levels, Ketoconazole may help to slow or even reverse hair loss in some individuals. Its antifungal properties are also possibly implicated in this effect. A study published back in 1998 found that over a 21 month period, men with AGA who shampooed with a ketoconazole shampoo showed significant increases in the proportion of anagen hairs as well as the average diameter of the hair follicle. Now, a quick word of caution, avoid shampoos that include sodium lauryl sulfate or sodium laureth sulfate. These chemicals are so-called surfactants and are used for cleansing and foaming agents. So while they can give the shampoo that rich lather and thereby leave the user with a superficial sense of cleanliness, their downsides are often not really appreciated. These are basically very harsh chemicals that are also used in industrial detergents and household cleaning products like laundry detergents, carpet cleaners, and stain removers. So in recent years, these chemicals have come under increasing scrutiny with many experts raising the alarm regarding their potential harm to the human skin. This is because these chemicals are common allergens and can irritate the skin leading to dryness and itchiness. And they can also severely irritate the eyes. Unfortunately, these chemicals are among the most popular surfactants in ordinary supermarket shampoos that you would buy off the shelf. So after years of research into the best shampoo ingredients, we formulated the sulfate-free hair guard shampoo. It contains most of these effective shampoo ingredients that we just talked about. In fact, the only one that it doesn't contain is ketoconazole. We simply didn't include it because 2% concentration of ketoconazole is a prescription medication. And that would have made ordering the shampoo very difficult. So if you're looking for a natural but powerful shampoo that helps stop hair loss without the unnecessary harmful ingredients, then the Hair Guard shampoo is for you. It contains caffeine, vitamin E, biotin, taurine, bamboo extract, and apple cider vinegar. 
and it contains enough of these active ingredients to actually make a difference. Okay guys, if you've got any questions, leave them down in the comment section below. I always respond to the good questions. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.